But uh, so you first have to treat your, I, you know, for, for people new to this, it's one of those things you just got to realize this is not a benign device, right? And most people are kind of coming around to this, especially people with health issues. Maybe your audience is a little hipper to this conversation as well. Yeah, they are. Um, so we can move beyond some of the kind of basics. But, you know, you don't put this in your body. You don't put this in your pocket. As you can see, mine is in airplane mode. Mm -hmm. So uh, I make sure that none, this is one of the main things, none of the different uh, antennas are turned on. I don't know how well that's coming across, but uh -huh, so I've got right. the cell off right here. I've got the Wi-Fi off. I've got the Bluetooth off. And then of course, in iPhones and, and some other phones, it might be different, but you actually have to go into the settings to turn off the GPS because those are four antennas that are competing for space in this little box. This is one of the hardest design qualities of these little boxes is to put those four massive antennas in here uh -huh. and not have them interfere with each other. And then what do we do? We turn it on, put it in our pocket, even when there's not Bluetooth devices that we need, even when there's not Wi-Fi that we're picking up, even when we don't need to use our GPS. But those four antennas are unconsciously left on for most people. So I'm very conscious to, uh, to make sure that if I, got, if I have my cell phone on, it's far away from me. It's, you know what I mean? I keep it in a place in the house where I'm, I'm at a great distance and there's walls and stuff between me and that. Um, okay, so again, I think it's just a matter of dealing with your computer does the same thing. Your computer might have Bluetooth, might have other, you know, the Wi-Fi, all these different things on it as well. And those are just as powerful as a Wi-Fi router. 